Is All right, there? Danny. Yeah, something's burning. Hey, real quick, back to the 15 zero inches. I, I queued this up, yeah. so can I please play it? Yeah. Here we go. How tall are you? I'm like 5'12". <laughs> Almost 6. <laughs> That is my favorite. Yeah, that was good. All right, Danny boy. Sorry, you got me going uh, now. No, I'm I'm sorry about that. I was that's all right. Pointing that's, that's all. You all understand. Right. That's all right. Okay, my question is: uh, every time that I have sex, actually, every time I jack off, for that matter, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, I I pinch it off at the very end, and uh, you know, run to the toilet or the the uh, trash can to let it go, just just to save myself from the mess. And mm-hmm. I'm wondering. Is that bad? Am I? Is something going to happen to me? Am I going to like you know burst does something it, eventually? Th- well, first of all, doesn't it sort of interrupt the pleasure of all that? No, not really. Actually, I, I right. don't mind. I've gotten so used. Really? Because to, so. to me, it feels like I a try to chore, sneeze, right? Yes, sneezing with that. That's a, like a, a distracting chore, right yeah. in the middle of uh, orgasm. Well, you know, I don't know. I, I developed a habit. And all right, it right here's like the deal. That. All right. Uh, secondly, yes, you can irritate your prostate and uh, cause some problems in the urethral outflow tract. Uh, secondly, and thirdly, how much of a mess is there as opposed to spraying a trash can of grabbing a little Kleenex? Well, Which is, that, well uh, like, like that, listen, Danny. Or, or being near first a off, toilet when you start all this. You, you've got to hone your technique so that you can do it like standing up in the shower. So oh, I can't. One. I can't. I've okay. tried. All right. Me. All right. Well, hey, hey, Danny, uh, yeah. when you use... Uh, words like I can't, uh, then you won't. Uh, <laughs> oh, okay? Because I couldn't either. But you know what? I overcame in the well, time. Every time I try, I'm always late for work. Takes a while. Well, yeah. that's, that's what you guys start getting up earlier. Uh, look, you, 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 right. you know what you need to work? You need to get a bib. You need to get a jack bib. <laughs> I'm telling you. Rag. Grab something from the hamper. How big a mess can that be as compared to what he's doing? I. The idea of pinching... First uh, off, I would rather have my mom burst into my room and yell at me to bust some dishes <laughs> while I was orgasming rather than pinch off my dork and then stand up uh, and make some sort of crazy craft my pants run for the bathroom. I, I, I couldn't... It, it, uh, it, I, I would... It would be a good way to get me to quit beating off. Yeah. It'd be like, oh, this Aversive is this tradition. annoying. Yeah, yeah this, this is- sucks. Yeah, uh, okay. Right. Come on, get the bib thing. Yeah, there you go. I, I, I'm telling you, I laugh. When I was 19, when I was, when I was Danny's age, I laughed at the bib, too. Really? Yeah. What did you do? My roommate, the Wheeze, was trying to explain to me about the bib, and I laughed at him. What did you take inst- What were you doing instead? That was making a mess on myself. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Some oh, of it's still probably humanity. there. Oh! oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh. It was not pretty. Yeah, it's it's, it's nah, peanut so, butter in the shag carpet. A lot of it's still there. Oh. A lot of it's still there. But anyway, I laughed at him, and you know what? Oh. He was right. And you know what? He saves humanity. It takes a very big man to admit when someone's right about the jack, yeah. babe. Giselle. Yeah. Your uh, Giselle was uh, the name he wanted to use when he was patenting the uh, jack, babe. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Call it the Giselle. Yeah. <laughs> Here's how it works. <laughs> we uh, use surgical tape to stick uh, the uh, one side of the Velcro to your sternum. Yeah. Right there. Yeah. And it's just permanently there. Yeah, yeah. You know, like people are on dialysis or have those little kidney machines or whatever. Yeah, they have or, a or jack the ports built in for, or, you know, ports Yeah, it's a port. It's a port. It's, it's just, it's surgically Velcro, yeah. it's, it's attached to your sternum. Yeah, surgically. And uh, then the bib, which uh, has a bullseye and a, a baseball diamond on the other side. <laughs> I rarely use it. Never use the diamond. Always With the, the Velcro's little, on both sides, you can attach either side. You just, yeah, you snap it on there. And uh, it's great. It's washable. It's a yeah. machine. You throw it right in the uh, dishwasher. Normal cycle. Uh, yeah. mm-hmm. You have a few of them, don't you? You got it. Well, you got to keep one in the car. Yeah. You know, if you travel like I do. <laughs> Giselle. <laughs> Good name for it. Did you gel? Giselle, yeah. And there's an advanced one that uh, also attaches uh, sort of a, sn- you, you attach it in the back like a cummerbund. Uh, actually, it becomes like the you know when you rent the tuxedo. Yeah, that like kind a snap of snap in the back. Yeah, you know it's like the just vest. to make sure it doesn't yeah, move. It just pull around. And and if you and if you let it doze, does it does it roll up and hit you in the chin? <laughs> yeah, only when you hit a high note yeah, when yeah, you're yeah. singing. Giselle. Yeah. All right, sorry. Now I can never hear that name again without cracking up. Giselle. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Um, I had a question. Um, 
I wanted to know, like, if it's bad. Um, like, well, last night, me and my boyfriend, we had sex. And, um, if I'm if what? Period. If it's I'm bad. My, if it's oh. bad. Because um, I'm, I'm, I'm on my period, and we had, like, unprotected sex. But, like, I'm on the pill, so that's why we didn't use a condom. And you're I'm on the pill, so you're... Ha and you've finished more than one month of the pill? Yeah. Yeah, you're, you don't need to use a condom unless you're trying to protect yourself against sexually transmitted diseases. You're completely... Well, yeah, but... So, I was on my period, and um, we had... Yeah, but the pill, the pill covers you the whole, as so long as you take it, whether you're okay. on your period or not. Okay. But, like, I mean, like... As far as like any diseases or like well, that's the more that's hand. the more significant issue is that uh, you can get what are called ascending sexually transmitted infections mm -hmm. and during a period. that's sort of more of an open conduit to the higher parts of the genital tract. You can get pelvic inflammatory disease, that sort of thing. So, from an infectious disease standpoint, the condom is important around the time of your period. But if it's a partner you've been with for a long time and he doesn't have any symptoms and you're feeling yeah. fine now, it's really it's it's also good for the yuck factor too. I the mean, condom. Yeah. yeah. We were to protect your pristine skin. It's just kind of like the way you use the Giselle. Yeah. yeah. All right, Giselle. I have to ask you one more other question. Yeah. yeah. Oh, real quick. Do you know those, like, those pills that are supposed to make your boobs grow? Do those really work? No. No? No. no. If, any, if anything would, the uh, birth control pill, the estrogens and the birth control pill for some women do. And they're finding actually now that liposuction makes some women's breasts grow, too. Yeah. Well, yeah, my, my, they have grown with, like, my pills as well, but I've been yeah. kind of, like, questioning as far as getting, like, a boob job or... Like, no, you're fine. Pills. You're fine. Why do you need the boob job? I, I don't know. I kind of... I don't know. I just kind of want them. No. Save that for the pros. What do you got? What do you got? A B cup? Um, I'm, like, in between a B and a C, but I... Just That's fine. That's the way most guys like it. Yeah, most women are going to a C cup when they get their enlargements done. So you're, yeah. you're already there. They're going down to uh, something. When they're going down to a C. Out. Yeah, out. exactly. C is what most people want. All uh, right. Good Let's times. Uh, the keep Giselle. Uh, roll along. Is there, is there a refinement on that name? The Giselle. The, G the Giselle. Yeah, it's a great commercial. Yeah. Guys beating off, making a mess. But, but fields of wheat. I see wheat's blowing in the wind. Walking around with... No, no, it's one of those, hey, uh, a guy's got a throw pillow stuck to his belly. <laughs> what happened, Bob? Why, why, why couldn't you make league night the other night? The bowling team lost because they yeah, had this, had this uh, throw pillow cleaving to my uh, sternum. Huh, haven't you heard about the Giselle? Giselle? What's that? I always like when they repeat it. They never just go, what's that? They got to repeat it. And you, you almost never do that. In real like, life. Like, yeah. yeah, like if you said uh, non, uh, like if you said uh, non gonococcus crop, what's your thing? Non gonococcal urethritis. You yeah. go, huh? Non gonococcal urethritis. Huh? What's that? No, you just go, what's, what's that? that? Yeah. yeah, that's how you do it. What are you talking about? The Giselle. What are you talking about? Yeah. All right. And it'd be one of those things, too, if you acted now, we'd throw in another one. Or maybe a travel Giselle. Or maybe a smaller one for uh, guys who are more accurate. <laughs> just mop. <laughs> They'll go with the Giselle. You know, on the Man Show, we invented the uh, belly Zamboni. Yeah. Yeah. I like the manual out. Masculine out. Masculine out. Yeah. That was his Come just, on, tell him what that it, was. It gets, pro, it gets stubborn protein stains. Male protein stains. Uh, That's right. Mom. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, there was a good good saying for it. It was like... Um, it was like uh, 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 put a squirt in every load or something <laughs> like that. <laughs> God. Well, it was in the washing machine. It had a contest. And I remember you had the, you had the sort of 70s style housewife with her hands on her hip going, oh, is that another one of these? The dog was licking it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Masculine. Is that another one of your masculine stains? Protein stains? <laughs> yeah, David. Oh, my God.